it's Little Miss Bliss. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Introducing first, from Columbus, Ohio, Alexa Bliss. Five feet of fury. I like how the NXT fans here act like they've been supporting Alexa the entire time. It wasn't until she left this popsicle joint she became a true sensation. Popsicle joint? How disrespectful can you be? Alexa has it all. Yeah, a bad attitude. Mickey James! And her partner from Richmond, Virginia, Mickey James. A six time champion. Who will ever forget the night when Mickey James challenged Asuka? at NXT TakeOver Toronto. Well, that performance that particular night opened the doors for Mickey's full-time return to WWE after several years away. Hey, if you think about it, Mickey started his career as an obsessed fan for WWE Hall of Famer Trish Stratus and has gone on to pave a Hall of Fame career in her own right. Girls. And their opponents, Billy Kay and Peyton Royce, the Iconics. Byron, you only harbor ill will toward Peyton and Billy because you can't sit with them in catering. Uh, absolutely not. I harbor ill will towards them because I've never seen two ladies who derive so much joy from gossiping and tossing shade at anyone they choose. Well, Peyton and Billy simply enjoy one another's company and spreading the good word around the locker room. They may or may not be two of my most trusted sources. Well, I believe that. This is iconic. The Australian duo have taken WWE by storm and show no signs of slowing down. Two ladies who have known each other since high school in Sydney, Australia, now causing havoc and dismay. And goodness gracious, they do great impressions. They're horrible. Oh, what a crash. And it looks like it'll be these two superstars kicking oh, it off here tonight. The only thing that would make this match more enjoyable to watch would be if I was calling it without you two bozos interrupting me. Neckbreaker! Breaking the rules! For many years, members of the WWE Universe and the WWE Locker Room have felt that tag team matches should have two referees. One referee is in the ring overseeing the action, and the other is located out on the floor, making sure teams follow. What's Peyton Royce about to make happen? She better do something fast. And she breaks free. I don't know how she did it, but that was impressive. Byron, earlier you raised a point that people have been talking about for years, and that's a second referee being appointed to tag team matches. I remember WWE Hall of Famer and former WWE President Gorilla Monsoon used to express his strong advocacy for two referees being appointed to tag team matches. Uh, it's something that's been talked about for decades, Michael, and I don't think it's ever going to happen. We've seen it on occasion, but I think it's best to let the superstars be responsible for themselves. And the appointed official for the match needs to do the job they're paid to do. I don't think it's that much to ask. In order to be a premier tag team, a superstar and their teammate must have that continuity. She's looking at it. 
She's starting to take a beating. She doesn't want this lack of momentum to snowball. The good, no, she breaks it. Wow, she's quite the escape artist, Michael. ago you took us through what it takes for a tag team to be successful the continuity between tag team partners is crucial when a team is able to keep one opponent in the ring for an extended period of time without making a tag they're able to focus their attack on one individual and one body part and that's when things really start to take shape if you're on the tag team that's in control of the match when you look at the tag teams who have dominated this business all of them worked well together as a unit and were able to keep an up and it's mickey james making a move I don't know if you guys have noticed, but when Peyton Royce walks out wearing that iconic t-shirt, she fights out. But that doesn't mean the damage wasn't already done, Michael. And the slam! Looks like she's starting to stumble a bit. Look out! There's the tag! And that changes the entire outlook for these women, Michael. And she drops her! That was about as in-your-face as it gets. I think she's trying to prove a point here. Billy Kay has her up. When it comes to Peyton Royce's, she might have it. Oh, spiking DDT. That was simply amazing. Oh, man, they don't even seem hurt after that. She came here to fight, not lay down. some agility. Uh-oh. Shoulder tackle. She's beginning to take some heat here. You can see her partner wants to get tagged in here. Vito, man, that hurts. When she gets in attack mode, here she comes on the counter. We'll see if she can turn things around. Oh man, she's rolling now. We're looking at complete domination here. Some good technique right there. And it's Billy Kay showing some agility. She goes down hard. She's going to be feeling that one for a while. Mickey James is finding herself in some serious trouble here. She may very well have reached the point of no return. His partner must feel absolutely helpless right now. The only thing he can do is stand there and watch his guy get completely decimated. Give her credit, though, guys. She may be on the wrong end of this battle right now, but she is showing absolutely no signs of giving up. Oh, man, what a hit. Knocked right off the apron. Look at the look in her eyes. She's in the zone now. Harsh impact. She comes up big with the reversal. Look at her go. Born in Australia, Peyton Royce's path to WWE saw her travel. She's turning the tables. They ain't turned yet. Still got some work to do. That's what they call me, the hot shot. And that's how a superstar takes advantage of their ring position. Such a high ring IQ. Corey, Byron did allude to Peyton Royce's training in Canada. Yeah, she's a product of your best friend Lance Storm, and that's one of the reasons why Peyton is so good in the ring. I'm just glad Storm's personality didn't rub off on her during training. You can see the confidence just beaming from her right now. She's looking at it. Slam down hard. That should do it. 
tag team history was made when the first ever SmackDown tag team champions. She's countering nicely now. Yeah, a second ago, she was almost done. I think she's trying to prove a point here. I don't think there are two teams I'd rather see square off against each other right now. This is amazing. There was a lot on the line. She might have it. Peyton Royce was able to get out of the way there. We're looking at complete domination here. She is on fire. that has been dealt out so far. The tag team partner has to be concerned at this point. You've got to give these women so much credit. They've really been put through the ringer here tonight. <laughs> Mickey James was able to get out of there. And it's Billy Kay showing some agility. Oh, and she gets out of the way. Oof. The tag team scene here in WWE is undergoing a bit of a renaissance, and it's because of action like this. A lot of pride on the line here in this tag team encounter, but only two of these competitors will end up getting what they came for, the win. What a strike. Spinning kick to the gut. Ooh, what impact. Look at him go. You can see the confidence just beaming from her right now. And it's Billy Kay showing some agility. And it's Billy Kay showing some agility. What a stop. Good grief. We've seen some great tag team action over the years here in WWE, and I can attest that this is no different. Oh, you're just asking to get disqualified. Well, if you ain't cheating, you ain't trying. Back in from the floor. Here she goes. Back in the ring now. Oh, oh, oh. We're over, Ronaldo. She looks for Mickey James with a mick kick. Wow, what a gritty performance. My goodness, that connected. And it's Billy Kay showing some agility. Tag is made. Hung up to dry. Oh, what a kick! I knew it was only a matter of time. That should do it right there. One, two, three! They did it! They won the match! Now let's take a look back at some of the great action. Remember this? Look at her go. She's taking care of business. Every single minute of this one was memorable.
big win here in tag team action tonight. I got a feeling they're going to be talking about this win for a while. I think I can safely speak for all of us when I say that was an amazing contest.